Okay, I am going to just, uh, I'm just basically showing a few little updates in the game that I've, I've done so far. Not, not significant, but uh, a few little minor things that for playability and also, you know, in introducing one of the new bosses that I'm still working on right now. So again, I only have one hand, so it's hard for me to actually really do much. So yeah, I'll put this allow it to just play down just for a quick second. And that's pretty much one of the new bosses right now that I'm introducing to the game. Um, it's probably, it's, I won't mention the name of the bosses yet, because that's a uh, little secret. Um, but currently right now, uh, I'm working out the boss me mechanics. You know, at least the, the bosses in the game. Just utilizing one of the other bosses mechanics right now, just trying to over. And about the move moving and so forth. I'm gonna get out of here because I only have one hand, so I can't really do much. Um, one of the modes that still remain is the mode called What the Heck mode, uh, which is pretty much a difficulty parameter test mode. Where I can actually test to see how hard um, certain things are. So for example, as you can see, the enemies are shooting at a much faster rate than uh, normal, and you take damage at a much higher rate. So it's just to test how you know, the the difficulty parameters of the game. Get out of here. We just went to the boss. I have a new button basically called New Level. That's just for me to actually beta test new levels as they as I put them out and um, see how they work. This way I don't have to try to play through all the levels to get to there. I just have a button that I can just quickly press and that's pretty much only available in beta. Uh, we, there is a web beta version which pretty much utilizes the same thing, which of course is not touch screen. So, oh, that hurt. Okay, as you can see, you have four different abilities deflecting, which can deflect any energy burst, it will not deflect most of the, the large rocks. Um, you have your regular shooting. Which is spread right now. You only have this is just the one upgrade for the weapon. I'll do more upgrades later. You have your grabbing and your shields. Your shields can take a beating up to a you know, since it's only one enemy shooting at you, no problem. But if you're in the hard mode, as you, I'll jump to that for you so you can see, your shields will not last that long if more enemies come in to play. Your shields will take heavy damage, especially from rocks. So normally the rocks you, you have to grab, in this mode you can't grab the rocks because the, the second you drop your shields, you have to worry about being shot at and you quickly die. So let me get back out. Um, cutscenes are still in the game. I am ramping that up right now. I'm working on storyboards for every cutscene. A few things are going to be changing, especially that ship. I designed a new ship that will be swapped into that one. I have to actually redesign it from, I did a sketch and I did um, some drawing, um, a 2D version of the ship, but I just need to do a 3D version and then it re it into the game. I might do dialogue trees, I'm not sure. Dialogue trees is something I'm thinking about, but I'm not sure if that might work for the game. Because it's pretty much, you know, it's a, a space shooter and uh, it does have uh, sequential order things and these basically details your abilities your beam weapon your grappling your special and deflect basically this uh, section will deal with your specials um, besides deflect I, I have to see how that works out and then of course you have your shields and uh, right now you have a little dialogue tree between well not a dialogue tree my, my mistake it is a dialogue between yourself and um, your companions. And that's about wrap things up for this minor update.